Hello, welcome back to Tarot Time with Andy. This is my vibrational reading. Please do your own research for entertainment purposes and allegedly. I'd like to find out, is Tori Spelling uh, headed for divorce? She wasn't wearing her wedding, wedding ring. Dean, uh, her husband, McDermott, uh, did some filming, was gone for six months, and she was seen without a wedding ring. They sleep in separate rooms, no big deal, because a lot of families do do that. However, people are speculating, so let's find out. There we go. Are those two headed for divorce? Are those two headed for divorce? So divorce cards tend to be in a combination. Usually you'll get like a three of swords, a tower, a five of cups, ten of swords, justice card. Those are your tend to be your divorce cards. Uh, also you can get like the devil with the ten of pentacles, ten of cups. So those typically tend to be the combinations here. So let's find out. Are they headed for a divorce? Are they headed for a divorce? There we go. Let's find out. What do we got here? Hmm. The world in reverse. So there's a lack of accomplishment going on with the marriage. They're not doing too good. It's not very successful. And But they're trying. They're trying to be strong. They are trying to be strong. Ace of Wands. That's a strength. A new beginning. So it's kind of, he's back from filming trying to be strong because things are feeling quite unfulfilled so they're trying for that strength oh gosh because there was no presence he was gone so it put a strain on the marriage him filming uh, and being gone for six months and then we have here the seven of cups in reverse so uh, they didn't get anything out of it they didn't feel like they gained any experience out of it and uh, emotionally uh, kind of in reverse here and so uh, I'd say that's kind of an emotional drain with experience, with the experience of him being gone was negative. It was, it was emotionally draining is I think the best way to put that. And we have here at Knight of Cups in reverse. So yeah, this, it, just the lack of his presence uh, was not uh, a happy one. So they didn't, the whole family kind of suffered with, his, um, with him not being there. So they weren't happy about that just do it attitude and him having to be gone. It was very emotional. Yep, it, it affected the lovers. It affected the relationship. And the outcome is they're having a hard time. Yep, they are having a hard time balancing their energies with each other uh, and staying, you know, s manifesting what they want uh, as a couple. And it's very emotional. This guy, there's water behind him. There's also, uh, yeah, there's water. So you can see there's emotions they're trying to balance. Uh, the, 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 these pentacles here is also like an earthbound, your, your body, two people trying to balance and, and it's, a, it's a juggling act and they're not doing a very good job of juggling, of juggling things. So they're having a hard time juggling things. Under the surface we have here, ooh, ace of cups in reverse. There's a loss of love, things they don't feel like it's a, a super nice emotional start so they're suffering. It's a suffering card right there. Yeah, this is not looking too good. And then we have here the three of wands in reverse. So that's, you know, upright. That is feeling like success is close. You've got opportunities. There's strength there. There's enthusiasm. But the enthusiasm's in reverse. There's low energy. Uh, they don't feel like there's much to look out for for the future. It's, it's looking kind of grim here, you guys. I'm saying no, they're going to get a divorce. Uh, I did do my pendulum, I will tell you that now. And I asked it and I got, I asked for one year, I got no, I got for two years, I got yes. So I figure they've got maybe two more years of being married before they divorce. So that is what I got from the pendulum. So I'm saying yes. So it's a double yes for me. Not going to work out. Uh, it's looking pretty sad for that many kids. So let's find out. How will they do? How will they do in the future? How will they do in the future? How will they do with co-parenting, I guess you could say? How will the co-parenting go? How will the future co-parenting go? How will it go? Do it again. Well, that wants out. I'm going to take it. Here we go. So this is really basically what they're unaware of because it's the bottom of the deck. What they're unaware of is they're going to be filled with lots of challenges and feeling disconnected from each other. So that's what's going on. Very disconnected and challenged. So that's how it's going to be being uh, 
uh, co-parenting. It's going to be very challenging from the disconnect. Uh, basically, that's it, it just spoke for me. So let's get some more. Let's see what else it says. It says here, the Knight of Wands. Yeah, he's kind of going to lose his steam and enthusiasm. There can be a lot of absence from him. And he is going to be very nostalgic, and he's going to feel like he doesn't want to come around, though. Because when the nostalgia card pops up, that means you don't really feel like you should be going in the, in the area. Uh, it, not necessarily a good card to see it, uh, necessarily, according to uh, Biddy Tarot. So he's going to feel like he, he's lost a lot of energy, energy and enthusiasm with the challenges here. So it's not looking good. It really is not looking great for even co-parenting. And yeah, she's going to get cold and nasty towards him. She's going to get very upset with him because he's not around. There's no options for her. She's going to be feel like she doesn't have options. And uh, what else do we have here? She's going to feel like he's being very selfish. And she's going to say that he needs to go inward. He needs to look at himself. Go look at yourself. Ooh. Yeah, that's what women say. And, you know, we have, to, we, have to, we have to weigh our options here. We need to balance ourselves with the two of swords. We need to get it together in our communication here. Uh, so it's a balancing act with the communication. And we also have here, you know, we need you as the leader of this family still. You still are the father. You still need to take charge. Uh, you still need to be, you know, a father source here. They need their father. And, um, you're, you know, you're not leaving us. You are not leaving us. And uh, this is an action that we need to overcome, but we're not overcoming it right now. We're not doing too good at overcoming this. So they're not overcoming it just yet. And it is a new emotional start for the family. And we have here, and she is self-sufficient. She knows she's self going to be self-sufficient financially, even with the partnership in reverse. She'll probably have her mom help her. I mean, her mom's a billionaire. And we have here, she's aware of all the problems and struggles that she's going to end up being, facing. So that is that. Yeah. Okay. Now let's get some uh, Kipper cards. Here we go. Some Kipper. Kipper cards on the divorce, separation, co-parenting. Here we go. We got here, she is going to be mature about it, a mature woman about it. We've got here, wow, and the main female. So she's going to definitely be primary caretaker of the kids and unexpected income coming in. Probably get it from her mother, help. And she is going to have that poverty mindset, though. There will be that poverty mindset, but the unexpected income is going to come in and save her. I would say this could be her mother here. This is her mother here. I would say this is, her, this, is um, do, uh, uh, la, la, la. this is Tori Spelling. And this is her mother here coming in for the rescue with the unexpected income to keep her from living in poverty. So it looks like her mom's going to step in, which is good, and, you know, high honor. So, and she will hold a high position with her now. And we have here inability to change because there's the death of the relationship. And there's an inability to change uh, the situation because it's in reverse. So, yeah, it doesn't look happy, you guys. I hate seeing that. But anyways, it is what it is. Okay, so let's get some Kipper, some Kipper here. Um, excuse me, Lenormand. <laughs> Lenormand on how is he going to handle himself? How is he going to handle himself during this? How will he handle himself? Dean, how will Dean? Dean will try and be the power and authority in the family. He will try and take the lead. Just like, because she's going to tell him to. And he's going to get the news from her. Get back over here. You need to be the father figure. You're the power and authority here in the family. It's going to eat at him. It's going to bother him. It's going to eat at him. He's going to have difficulties with it, uh, with the mouse here. Uh, the, the mice is stress and chaos uh, and problems and loss. So he's going to have a hard time facing all the losses, the problems, and the chaos with the co-parenting. And then we have here, and it's going to be a burden, pain, and suffering. Uh, under it, what he's unaware of will be uh, the woman in reverse. So the fact that she's probably going to lose total interest in him at this point in time um, because I got, I, I'm just going to keep it in reverse. She's going to lose a lot of interest in him. Um, so she won't, ha she won't be loving him anymore. She'll, she'll, she'll fall, fall out of love, basically. Yeah, and she's going to self-flagellate over the situation. So, yeah. Mm, okay. All righty. Let's get some more. How will they fare as a family overall? How will they fare as a family overall? 
how will they fare as a family overall? Overall, when it's all said and done, they will be, they will have roses, three of hearts. So that is creation. So they're gonna try and create some new memories, new sweet memories. And they also will try and turn the water into wine, take a bad situation and make it better. And, and, and they're going to overcome it. It's gonna be an emotional hurdle to overcome, which they will overcome. And home, greatest energy, a strong, strong home foundation. So it's gonna be fine. They will be fine. Struggles, yes, but ultimately they'll be fine. Hand in hand in unity in reverse, so they will not be working well together. Co-parenting, there will be struggles, like I said. And in the center of the situation, fence sitting. He's gonna do a lot of fence sitting because he's not liking this, this adjustment and the conflicts. There's gonna be emotional conflicts. And the emotional conflicts are going to be over the harmony of money. Uh, they're gonna have a hard time harmonizing their money. Yes, so let's calculate this. Comes to 15 there. 15 comes to four of clubs. That's four leaf clover, getting lucky. They're gonna view that this, this new stability is getting lucky. And 10, 11, 11 comes to three of clubs, blackbirds, communication, electronic communication. So they will do a lot of their co-parenting through electronic communication. Well, that is it. Very short spread. I hope you enjoyed this. Until next time, like and subscribe. Bye.